Hello? Everyone. I think we're on with the Angel of the Stage. Apparently our Waffle Galaxy has need a video. Hey, Angel of the Stage. Here we come. No one minds Angel of the Stage. It's never been a spoiler. So this is probably the last bit in the English zone. Through the second door, it isn't centered during the zoom. I hate it, and my OCD hates it too. Also, the door just opens itself. There's an obvious cut in the audio here from the extra part of the song they stuck on for the intro to the beginning of the actual song. I love Alice's hands clip through each other. I love you, oh, Not one second later, her hand clips directly into her chest. Second strike for clipping. I love you, oh, Third strike for clipping. Five cents for the rest of the clipping in this video. Oh, you've been waiting for me. The bottom of Alice's dress freaks out as she's stepping into frame. Also, Alice's hair stays slightly pulled to her right after swooping in, even after she's come to a stop. Oh, gosh, you make me blush. Bless. Alice's arm just comes off her body for a moment. That can't be healthy. One, two, three, four. I got the tape so starting and that light isn't centered. I know this kind of building isn't too concerned with presentation, but still. Got the tape so starting and it's set at home. And There's no up and down movements as Alice walks here. Ten, five, six, seven, eight. Give me the beat, I'm like a nigga off the stage. And I'm Alice's arm disappears for a frame here. And I will take it from here, so don't you have anything? These splatters all over the place are pixelated to the point of looking super blurry. And I will take it from here. I know we send clipping all at once, but seriously. The suitcases literally just clip through the bed as she flips them up. Also, those are the thinnest dang suitcases I've ever seen. Have any this dresser is so tall, Alice needs to be on her toes just to get to the second drawer. She can't even reach the top one. The motion blur effect on these two blocks. I, I mean, dresses, is just absolutely atrocious. Yeah, Hold on a minute. Alice entered a door that was on the left, but she exits the room through a door on her right. The splatter of ink on the wall in the back are the same, so the camera couldn't be facing the other side. Man, the physical expectations of women is even shown in a Minecraft Bendy video. Alice's dress gets stuck in midair when she finishes her half twist. Also, the animation here at the end of the shot looks super linear. These people were not here a moment ago. Also, this guy is way too overexposed. In the next scene, the two people on the left and the guy in the black suit in the back are gone. These have to be some of the worst continuity errors I've seen, adding five cents. That woman in yellow in the back goes completely still for a few moments. This guy has what looks to be a Fender Stratocaster on his wall. We can assume this takes place around the 50s, as we see cars, clothing, and phones from that era. Strats were developed around the mid-50s, so having the Strat on the wall is fine, as it was one of the most popular guitars around then. But this variant, the HSS or Humbucker Single Coil, weren't around until the late 80s. That is literally the worst way I've ever seen someone hold a pen or pencil. Alice doesn't read the contract at all. She just signs it without any hesitation. Anyone with a shred of common sense knows never just to sign things blindly. Ah, to throw an object into the air for dramatic effect, only to have it land back in your hand well past when it should have actually fallen down, cliche. Guys! Above the ground. 
Also, the lighting here looks like the animators just took a recording of their software's viewport. The partition Alice changes clothes behind should be much taller. Things are just not the right size in this video, it seems. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be hairspray or perfume. If it's hairspray, she's spraying it directly on her face. If it's perfume, she's spraying it directly on her face. <laughs> Girls on the team are appalled. Lipstick has never and will never apply that in school. It takes a back and forth and lip popping to make sure it's properly coated. Not only can you just open it and well have I got the problem with just just look in the girls on the go. So don't wait. <laughs> I can't subscribe. 